there, it's Julianne Jones here with another video blog post for you. I wanna talk just briefly about host coaching. And one of the biggest um, objections I hear when I train this topic is, I just don't have the time to do in-person host coaching. You know, now assuming that the people that you're, you're working with, the hosts that you're working with, live demographically close enough that you could go and meet them for a cup of coffee or you know a quick soda or a bite of lunch even, Assuming that that's the case, I want to talk a little bit about this concept of I don't have time for this or I just don't know if I can squeeze this into my life or my day. I want you to think about, first of all, what would you think if I told you that I was going to give you a job where at least half your time you were going to be paid for going and having coffee with someone and making a new friend or getting to know someone better you know, by sitting down with them? Chances are good you'd say, I'll take that job, you know. You almost might even do it without being paid to do it. And if you think about host coaching in those terms, it really sort of changes that whole feeling around commitment. And that's exactly what you're doing when you're, when you're actively host coaching. You're sitting down with that host, you're learning more about them, you're making sure that they're clear about the experience that they want to have, the party they want to have, you're educating them about how to be successful, and it's a complete win-win. And you walk away, at the very least, with the host that's committed, and, and possibly even with a new recruit lead. Because uh, I think the DSA says 85 to 95% of all direct sales individuals, um, consultants, started out as hosts. So you can use that opportunity while you're comfortable, while you're you know, visiting with that person, getting to know them, to actually share your opportunity. So that's the first thing. If someone were paying you to go to coffee with someone and get to know them better, would you take that job? Probably. So think of it in those terms. And secondly, I understand that it's a bit of a time commitment and I want you to know that I, I realize that and that I realize it's going to take probably some effort on your part to actually fit it into your life and schedule. But what if the payoff for, for you, if you did that, was virtually no cancellations in your schedule? In other words, hosts who were holding their parties on the day they agreed to, and if they were showing up you know, at those parties, there were guests there. When you got there, everybody was excited, looking forward to the experience, and it was a living room full of people. Would that be worth it to you? Because I happen to know that the greatest frustration that most direct sellers have, and in fact, a lot of the reason that people quit is because their parties aren't holding, their hostesses are blowing them off and they're frustrated, and so they just give up. That piece of it will virtually end if you're doing this part, if you're investing in creating a relationship with that person so that she likes you and she's committed to you at the same level that you're committed to her. So that's what I want you to ask yourself. Would it be worth it to you if it would eliminate cancellations, make your parties more successful and more lucrative? Of course it would. So hopefully that gives you some food for thought. If you're not host coaching now, I really want you to consider it. I actually put a link this time down below um, to my Coaching Your Host for Maximum Success program. It's a great program. Soup to nuts takes you from the minute you meet the host or you, or you book the host at the party from, from where they book all the way through to closing their party. And um, it'll really support you if you need some support around that. It's a systematic approach. Anyway, I hope you're having a fabulous day. I'm looking forward to hearing back from you. Um, I'd love to hear your comments on this topic. I'd love to know how I can support you. If you haven't checked us out on the fan page yet, go to Direct Sales Success made easy with Julianne Jones. If you type that in the search bar in Facebook, you'll find me. It's also on the front of my homepage. If you want to look there, you can actually become a fan there as well. Hope you're having a great day and I'll talk with you soon.